Matthew Bass and I'm a professional wake skater and instructor at the Water Post in Port Edward, Kusalu Natal. Um, yeah, it's quite a list actually, but I think the most important thing or the thing that I love the most is that that's what I've loved to do since I was a kid. So I get to spend time on boats, spend time in the water, and more importantly, get a lot of time in on my wake skate. So I think that's pretty much, that sums it up. It's what I've loved to do since I was young, and that's what I still love to do. And it's, I look forward to waking up every morning and doing it. Probably more, more than anything that people I've come across have helped me the most. Like I've been really fortunate with the people who have helped me with wake skating from the beginning, from lifts to places and towing me and letting me ride their boats or do whatever. So definitely the, the people around me and support I've got from family and friends um, is definitely the main thing. And then probably general persistence or stubbornness, I suppose, in a way, not, <laughs> not giving up. <laughs> that's, that's an important one. So, yeah, probably that. Yeah, like I say, passion is progression. Probably someone that sets an example, someone that knows knows when to push and knows when to let off. So someone that knows when to take like someone's personal interactions into account or you know, knows how to properly inspire someone not just for the sake of their own their own gain. Someone who will see how they can integrate what they want to do with what the other person wants to do and build towards doing and achieving one goal that benefits both people at the end of the day I'd say that's probably a good leader yeah the list is big I'd say from when I was young I always looked up to any kind of sportsman so those kind of people are always they're always inspiring because they're people who go out there and do what they want to do and, and make it happen you know chase things till they get them done so I think Every sportsman from when I was young and playing cricket and soccer has always inspired me in one way to try to reach what I want to do. And then, yeah, the, the, funnily enough, I've been inspired by people in wake skating and then been fortunate enough to meet them and live with them and be educated with them. Guys like Dita Humsh, who lives in the States now, and Nick Taylor, who, you know, like they're both guys that I based my riding on and idolized as such and then met them and then they became one of those important people that helped me which makes them more of an inspiration because if I could do that for someone, that would be the ultimate goal at the end of the day. <laughs>